Hello, my name is Adam Bean and today I would like to show you how to monitor transactions in the Whitefly application server. So I um, implemented a uh, minimalistic Java e application just comprising one class transactions resource, which is an EJB. So every method starts and commits the transactions. Uh, however, the rollback method uh, rollbacks the transactions, so the transaction is going to be rolled back by calling this method. So everything is deployed on the Whitefly application server, Java e supporting Java e 7. So um, what I have, the browser, so where if I invoke commit, it will commit the transaction. So just, uh, I just will add some noise to that. So we see something happens, it's not cached. And the same should happen with the minus here. So just go for, with that. So, and try this. So we have, it's the timestamp and the commit also works. So, and I would like to connect via JMX with the application server. I'm using the old-fashioned J console. You could use uh, the J Visual VM as well. Um, so, um, connect. And what I'm in most interesting interested in is the Mbeans view. The uh, what I would like to do is to uh, to uh, inspect the uh, JMX beans. And um, so there is an AAS folder. This is this what interests us. And you will find here in transactions bean, uh, it is somewhere transactions. And there are a couple of attributes, and this is what's actually interesting. So we see here number of aborted transactions, application rollbacks, and in-flight transactions. So let's do, so we commit something and we roll back a couple of transactions. And refresh. And we see that nothing happens. And the reason for that is, so there is one attribute, one attribute, sorry, one attribute, and it's called enable statistics. And these statistics are disabled by default. So what I would like to do is to change it to true. And um, just go back again and try it. And still nothing happens and the reason for that is uh, we have to reload all these subsystems or even easier i would just restart the application server so it is a quick process so it should work so then we have to reconnect of course because there is a new process so i will come here insecure ambience there is uh, something wrong I wanted to connect with the Whitefly again. Mbeans and there is the JBoss AS folder and we will find transactions. Transactions, attributes. And we see statistics are enabled. So Whitefly remembered this decision and uh, see what happens. So I will just initiate one rollback and we see we have one rollback. And uh, let's try a commit. And we have, uh, sorry, commit, <laughs> commit, a few commits, and we have some commits. So um, it is fairly easy to uh, to monitor subsystems in Whitefly. Most of the subsystems comes with disabled statistics like uh, transactions does. And of course, what we could do, we can access the same information via REST.